Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode, episode 9 of Tis and Wurrings. And today, Tis and Wurrings, we have Rudy Page. Welcome, Rudy. Welcome. Hello, hello. How are you, Rudy? Lekker. Excellent. For the people that's in Japan, tell them what position do you play for the Blue Bulls? I uh, play scrum up for the Bulls. For Best position on the field. Scrum up. Why oh, is wait. that? That's the, the... It's the guy that makes all the decisions and stuff. The important guy. Oh, so why, if you make all the decisions, do you have to tap the scrum when you throw the ball in? Can the hooker check the ball's gonna come in? Aye, bro, they close, they're inside there. They're inside, yeah. so, so you have to make them aware. I understand. Rudy Page, tell the people in the world what you do in your off day. Off day pretty much is golf. I like to, I don't know, they call me the charity of the Bulls. I like to lose a lot of money on the golf course. I like to lose some balls. Uh, so with the guys at home, pretty much talk a bunch of nonsense. So you are bushy. You're yeah. always in the bushes when yeah. <laughs> you play golf. <laughs> pretty much, eh? I come there with a big rep and then after like the, the first nine, I always want to go home. What's your handicap? I play about 18. I 18? Think, I think I'm actually 24, but the guys don't want to allow me to play with 24. Yeah, okay. What's your lowest score you eat? My lowest, 88. I'm 88, not. 18, 88. So, <laughs> yo, my goodness. At what cause was this? At who deal? Uh, say again? Who deal? Oh, who deal. Oh, yeah. okay. Yeah, that's, that's it. You can't say too much because Rudy Page's father is actually a pastor, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> <laughs> Just tell the people there. Eh? Yeah, I'm a preacher's child, so obviously I'm the guy sitting in front of the church, so I'm, I'm very chilled. Don't go out and stuff, I don't drink and so on. Excellent, <laughs> excellent, you see. So uh, speak to me about your quick hand. Um, what do you want to drill this so? What do you know that? Uh, the quick hands basically is just a repetition. It's just... Uh, so how many balls did you do actually of that in a row? Yes, we normally got 20 balls that slaps of foot out. I normally hate it for that. But it's just doing the same thing, like uh, so muscle memory and all of that. Oh, that's like a golf swing. Yeah. yeah. You got to do it over and over. Like, then it comes naturally after three or four months. Lekker. I saw you guys um, practice the box kick. There was this number, what's that guy's name, the number 11 again? Um, the big one. Tamba. Tamba. Hey, Tamba. <laughs> so you have to kick the ball high enough. Yeah. So that Tamba can go around and go tackle the person that is actually catching the ball. Yeah. That's basically what it is. The huh? height, the timing of the ball in the air, so you got enough time to go. Yeah, you know. that's 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 like choir. That's like a taxi driver. It's easy for me. I just got to kick it and wait. Yeah, you, but you have to kick it a certain way, in a certain height. Because yeah. if it goes out, then there's so much line out to a scrum, and then the captain is going to be upset with you. Yeah, and obviously, the guys give you a little look when you give it. Yeah, the, the fly-off will be like, who come in from me? in here come box kick. Yeah, Flop, it's a lot of training, to be totally honest. But then after that, it comes naturally. Ladies and gentlemen, Rudy Page. Thank you very much, my man. Salute, Masakan. So, Mark, you used to passing the ball from the back to the front to the midfielders. Uh, will you be able to pass the ball with your hands? I'm going to give it a go. Um, yeah. prefer watching rugby than football. Um, it's a fantastic sport to watch. Yeah. But but play, I'm not yeah. sure I want to get tackled and crunched by those big yeah. but anyway. So, um, what's the secret of passing a soccer ball? Um, I think you have different ways where you can pass it off your foot, but um, the easiest, simplest is the inside of your foot because that's generally the where you pass the ball the most and the most accurate. Right, ladies right. and gentlemen, Mark Fish showing us how to pass the ball. Can you do this, Mark? Can you do this? 